mentioned Duke Johnson and some teams are interested. Let's take a look at what we're uh, what we're looking at or what the Browns are looking at. So uh, this is what uh, has been gleaned by running backs. 2010, the Bills trade Marshawn Lynch to the Seahawks. They get a 2011 fourth round pick and a 2012 fifth round pick. That doesn't seem like a lot, does it? That for, paid off. For a more accomplished uh, running back. Than Duke but Johnson. how about this one? The Browns trade Trent Richardson to the Colts and they get the 2014 first round pick. That was the best get by any team for a running back. That was uh, uh, Chuck Pagano being famously quoted calling Trent Richardson a rolling ball of butcher knives. <laughs> 2017, the Dolphins trade Jay Ajayi to the Eagles. I didn't pronounce that right, but they received the 2018 fourth round pick. So there you see it. And the Browns traded Carlos Hyde, although nobody thought that was a great deal getting him in the first place, right? And they get a uh, fifth round pick in exchange for that. Yeah, I mean, clearly there was that was part of the dysfunction, I think, of this organization where uh, the front office wanted to clear the path for Chubb, who wasn't getting his enough, enough carries under Todd Haley and Hugh Jackson. In 2018, the Packers trade Ty Montgomery to the Ravens. They get a 2020 seventh round pick. How about that, a seventh round pick? You have no idea where that's going to be in the draft because uh, it's so far away. But the point is, teams don't. Teams rarely take running backs that high, and teams rarely trade for running backs that high. Yeah, and the great running backs aren't made available via trade. So. That was my biggest issue with this is that he's a guy who, you know, carried the ball only 40 times last year, but I think in all uh, had over 650 yards between uh, receiving and, and running from scrimmage, scored three touchdowns as a receiver. He's very valuable on third downs, and I don't think you're going to get the right value back in a deal. Why is it that the fans like him more than – because I think fans and... see him, you know, for the longest time, now it's a little different, but for the longest time fans saw him as one, as maybe one of two playmakers on offense, and right. he still wasn't getting the ball. Uh, his, his carries were, uh, you know, a four-year low last year. Yeah, um, he the, had one game where he had nine, car nine touches. Yeah, so I don't think he's – well, Ch if Chubb and Hunt are – uh, are sharing the the load. He's not going to get very many carries, but I do think he's a, he's a really valuable uh, third down guy. And again, nobody's going to walk up to you and say we'll give you a second or first rounder for Duke Johnson right now. If they do, then I I would consider that deal too. Let's.